Hello, this is MakerJ everyone, and here's my um, little uh, compressor here. I was, I've um, let the refrigerant out and I'm using it as a vacuum pump. Um, so here's the, uh, um, I just made this, it's a glass jar and I put a hole in the side here. Um, I used a um, little vibrating um, uh, engraver and I just kept it in one spot and it popped the hole right through there. Um, it worked pretty good too, it didn't shatter it or anything. Um, it made a nice little hole. Um, but I was trying to make a cathode ray tube or CRT or something like that, but it didn't really work. I don't think I have enough of a vacuum. Uh, <clears throat> um, but so what I d did here is I just have a jar um, with a vac with a um, normal pressure gauge, and I'll switch on the pump, plug it in. ray tube so I don't know if any could tell me if that'll work or not I tried also making a vacuum tube but that didn't work either um, but as you can tell the compressor just got silent so it's not um, not pumping anymore but yeah, it's about a little bit more than 13 so um, I was wondering one thing um, if I hook this other compressor up in series might I be able to get it down to a lower vacuum um, because I'd like to get it down, because, I mean, this isn't really useful for me. Um, a vacuum pump would be more useful. I'd like to try to make a vacuum tube or cathode ray tube or something like that. So, um, if somebody could tell me if I connected these in, um, series, if they would, um, uh, produce more of a vacuum. So, so yeah. Um, another thing, I'm not going to be making any videos in the next two weeks, so, so yeah. Thanks for watching.